Well, happy Halloween, everybody. Uh, you might have seen this video. I made these last year. Just some uh, dollar store foamies. Anyway, they're great. So I decided to up my game a bit this year. And I got, uh, I got these guys, which are <laughs> pretty huge. I've not done anything this big before. So this should be uh, pretty interesting. Well, chatter on the wire, here's a look at my wood pile. But uh, yeah, it's getting cold. I'm planning on doing some casting in a couple days here. I wanna bring some sand indoors, uh, just so it's not completely freezing. Here's my uh, tire collection. But uh, yeah, in my woodshed, I just kinda I got kind of a three, three tiers of logs in the front, so it looks nice from the front, but I store all my crap back here. So good spot for sand and aluminum and whatever. But anyway, I'm gonna clean up my sand before I bring it in. Uh, I just got this uh, dollar store trash can. It's got a pretty big mesh, but it uh, filters it pretty quick. But anyway. That's what I use. It'll be hard to do this one-handed, but I'll come back. Yeah, so I just fill up the trash can, lift it up, and it runs out pretty quick. Good way to get all the leaves and big chunks of uh, plaster and stuff out of there. So I got three ready to go here. Um, it's just coated in some drywall plaster, some thinned down drywall plaster. And uh, anyway, I'm gonna box these up and get them ready to go. So I had to make up some, uh, some boxes to fit these in. They don't fit in my propane tanks, but yeah, should be enough room in there. Uh, it holds about 33 liters, which is around nine gallons. So I guess two of these cans should fill one. So I'll get that set up and ready to go. So I put it in the box, filled it up, compacted it down when it was sitting up straight. But I want to pour it on a bit of an angle. That's, that's a recommendation from Kelly Cofield. I guess, I'm not sure why, I guess maybe it slows down the flow a bit I, I don't know but anyway I gotta I put a little hook on here to, to support my can and I got a, a bracket there sitting on the can so it should be safe Holy smokes. This thing's huge. Sick.
So I was getting these ready to clean up, and then the wife came out and seen them. And she's like, "Oh, they're so good." She doesn't want me to. She doesn't want me to brush them off because they look like stone. They look old. They look awesome. So I'm gonna take them up and give them a pressure wash. I think get some of the plaster off them. The pressure washer won't take the oxidization off, so I think they'll still look really good. But yeah, I agree. I think it's better than the polished look. So I'll bring you up to the pressure washer and hose them off. Alright, so I got these uh, galvanized bars. I'm gonna bolt onto the back so I could pound in the ground as a support. So I drilled my holes in the bar where I want them. So I'm just gonna transfer that to the transfer that to the casting. So I set my def stop on the press so I won't drill all the way through the piece. Happy Halloween, everybody. <laughs>